Hi everyone and welcome back to the Happy Heart. I'm so glad that you guys came by today to see my really small filler Walmart haul. I actually moved over the weekend and my house is atrocious. Like it's a mess and I keep re-washing everything because I don't know, I have OCD so it's taking me a little bit longer but I ran into Walmart for literally milk. I'm sure you guys have done this. Like you've gone to Walmart for one or two things and $55 later, I'm showing you my Walmart haul. So let me show you guys what I got just to kind of get me through until I do an actual big grocery shopping. Um, when I moved, I realized that I had a lot more in my freezer than I knew about. I think I'm gonna try to stretch that a little bit and uh, before I do a big grocery haul. So show you guys what I got. All right. All right guys, so this is it. It's a tiny, I told you, but it was still $55. Can you believe that? Whew. But anyway, I got two cucumbers just for snacks. I got some carrots that I could cut up um, for snacks for Anthony and Ryan. And I got peppers because I was craving peppers and this was actually, for three of them was $2.68, which I thought was really good, and I'm going to cut them up and just snack on them. That's something I like to do, and I was going to get a red and an orange one, and if I would have bought them separate, it would have almost been the same price, so that worked out. I grabbed some clementines because oh, I, I love these. Ryan loves these. It's great. Um, I got uh, some really, really green bananas because I wanted them to last a long time. Uh, got cottage cheese because I love to have that in the morning. I uh, got two things of ground beef and um, these were like the last 80-20 ground beefs that they had, but they had a bunch of ground bison if you will can believe that. I was very surprised. I uh, went ahead and grabbed some milk. That's what I actually went in for. I uh, grabbed these no-bake cookies. They're peanut butter. They're, it's not focusing, but peanut butter fudge cookies. They're a no-bake cookie. You can actually make these. I've never tried to make them, but I should. But they're kind of my vice. So I just got Usually I get kind of a bigger tub of them, and I thought, no, 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 I'm going to get a small pack. <laughs> um, went ahead and got some goldfish for Ryan, and then some non-food related items. Is I got this shower curtain because it says it's extra long, and my shower curtain, I got a 72 inch, and it doesn't even go into the bathtub. And actually this is a liner, it's not even a shower curtain, it's the shower curtain liner. So. Cross your fingers that this will work. It says it's 78 inches. I don't know if it'll work that much better, but I'm gonna hang it up and see. And if it doesn't work that much better, I'm gonna take it back and probably go to Bed Bath & Beyond or somewhere like that. Um, I'm actually out of my IT Confidence Cream and I grabbed this because I looked online to see what was comparable and they said Pond's was the comparable brand. I never tried it before, have no idea. Could be good, could be bad, no idea. So this is just facial moisturizer till I can get over to uh, Ulta and I don't have an Ulta in my town so it's a little bit of a drive. I went ahead and grabbed Daredevil because I haven't seen this movie. It's the one with Ben Affleck and I wanted to show it to my son actually. Um, and it was only like $5 so. And then this was actually the find of the day, let me tell you. It's an eyeliner by Physicians Formula, which I don't know much about, but I hear people talk about it. But it was on clearance for dun, 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 a whole dollar. I like these kind of eyeliner pencils. It's really hard to see that you can kind of click them up. And that's, here's it. So you can kind of click them up, and then it's easy to put on eyeliner that way. So that's it for me guys, that was my Walmart haul. I actually went in for milk and the shower curtain liner. I really wanted to look at that too. And I knew I needed bananas because if you could see, my bananas have gone bad. I need to freeze those. Thanks for coming over and I will see you guys again in my next haul. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and those bell notifications so you know every time I put up a brand new video. Thanks and I'll see y'all again, bye.